This is how most amateurs create their website, apps, and stuff like that. They have a prompt, they have an idea for a website, and they say, create a website for my SaaS startup that does AI video editing. And they would just send that, and in a few seconds, you'll see the result. And this is what amateur would receive. As you can see, we just wrote the prompt, and this is what, what, what you would receive in many times. It's not just Webflow, or it's not just Lovable. It is would be the same with Cursor, with Windsurf, whatever you use. This is probably what you would get without using the strategies that I'm gonna show you. But if you do, you can build something like this, totally, entirely built with uh, Lovable, you can build this nice interactions, even this background animation here, you can see you can implement that very easily here. All of these things, the mark you animation here, you can also build stuff like this with background videos, animations, with obviously everything here is mobile responsive, and tablet responsive, and you can build like this if you follow the strategies that I'm going to show you. Because the problem with this is that you're guessing, you're just writing prompts, maybe ask ChatGPT to write your prompt, and ChatGPT might write you a prompt, but the result will be not predictable, and you will waste a lot of credits, you will waste a lot of energy trying to come up with something, and then you will get mad that this is not what you were expecting, and then you will stop building with AI, then you will be left behind, because people who build with AI will have the leverage to make money. If you know how to build with AI, if you know how to design beautiful product that people will be hooked on with AI whether it's websites whether it's web apps because I will explain how to make and adapt it for mobile apps web apps whatever you're building if you know how to make sure that lovable does or any other website builder does what you want it to do you will get access to the designs like this you will get designs like this without a problem I've been designing websites for more than 10 years so I can show you the whole process I know the behind the scenes how to take beautiful resources where to take them how to get them for free and what exactly you need to do to get to the results like this and the first step is actually getting to a Figma community, which is the best free resource that there is. Obviously, if you have more money to spend on paid resources, there is a resource like Webflow that you can get beautiful Webflow, uh, not Webflow, Lovable templates straight for Lovable for beautiful AI startups that you can get that are really well designed and you can get the remix link straight into here. There's also websites like um, 21st Dev or something like that. And but here I'm going to show you the first result that is free and this is the Figma community. So once I'm here I can click on Figma community here. I'll just click Figma profile and here I have the ability to search and what I'm going to do is I'm going to type landing page and then I'm going to scroll through all the landing pages that they have here because then I can take the styles and then I can build something like that and this will be predictable. I don't have to start from scratch. This applies to any area of your business, whether you're bu building a product, web app, course, whatever. You don't have to start from scratch. Like if you have money to invest, you can buy businesses. You can invest in private equity and uh, obviously, if you don't have, you, you have to start from scratch, but just keep it in mind for the future. The same with the websites. If you don't have any money, again, you can start absolutely from scratch, but you can have a little bit to invest. You can find something that you like. And here, what I'm going to do is in Figma community, I'm just going to scroll through all of these websites and I'm going to look for the styles that I like. And it's nothing complicated. Like you can see linear app style collection. I can click on this and then I can click open in Figma and see what this dude has to to offer then I can click on his profile and see maybe he has something more beautiful so even if you want to implement these beautiful crystals you can copy them this is all free as you can see I but I don't need really that so I'm gonna go back and find one more reference and see what I like here so let's say we like this Uniswap landing page we can also open it in Figma and I like the cars that they have here and once I open it in Figma, I now have access basically to all of the styles, all of the colors, and totally, hopefully, editable here. Yeah, as you can see, it is totally editable. So you can start editing it and you can start adapting a few things. Obviously, you don't want to really copy exactly as it is, but like you have access to all of the styles. So what you can do now is you can select any of the styles that you like. Let's say I like this style, it is. it looks pretty cool. And what I can do now is I can copy, make a copy of this, put it in here, and I can start editing right now. So I can remove this background, 
these images as you can see they are logged right now so unfortunately i cannot remove them i need to spend like a few seconds to find them but that's not what i'm going to do i'm just going to remove a lot of the different sections that i don't need because i just need to give lovable a style that i wanted to do so let's say we're just gonna keep these two sections at the top and we're just going to make it like this and then i'm going to open plugin which is figma to code or not figma to code uh yeah figma to code so you can open it and then you'll have access to the code here we're going to make sure that this is selected and then we have access to that code yeah so i'm just going to use this uh, thing here it's the same plugin here and now once i'm here i can select this and i'm just going to copy this i'm going to go to lovable let's go here lovable and then i'm going to type type take this code and turn this into a responsive responsive here responsive site let's say uh so we're exceeding a little bit of the code so what i need to do here is remove a few other elements that i don't really need so let's say i don't need this thing i also don't need this thing let's move it up a bit and also i would prefer to remove this thing with yeah like this because lovable cannot take any images from figma so now i can do the same thing i can copy the code hopefully now we're good i'm gonna delete that and yeah now we're good so i'm just gonna send it and see the result and this is the result that we've got so power generative ai with your data Obviously, the content is different from what we got, but for the first prompt, it is pretty good. And yeah, it is responsive for mobile as well, which is awesome. So the next step, what we do is, unlike the first time, we just send create a website for my SaaS startup that does AI video, and this was the result. Now we can go to the chat GPT, whatever you use, and we're going to say create a copy for this site. Uh, create a copy for a site and we're just going to remove the web search and we're just going to send it so we give lovable to work with something we have the feature section uh, let's say hero section feature section uh, benefits section security section test Testimonials and the CTA and footer. And now we're gonna send it and we're just gonna copy all of the text that we got here and we now can go to Lovable and we're gonna just paste this text. But I'm also gonna say a few things to Lovable. So I'm gonna say build the rest of the homepage using the same style, colors, font sizes, elements, etc but feel free to create sections and edit the current section text as needed. And I'm gonna send all of the text that we got from Perplexity and let's see the result. And this is the result that we've got from just two prompts, literally two prompts, and this is the result that we've got. And all of this is mobile responsive. All of this section is exactly as we described. So as you can see, all of the text if i scroll down here and we can see that we said the text feature section and this is the feature section so above the fold smart editing tools everything you need automated we have bullet points for items outer cat smart color voice cleanup everything in terms of structure is perfectly here so not only the design is on point without guessing without trying different styles we have exactly what we needed with all of the different sections with all of the beautiful animations and yeah all of this is fully responsive like you could never do the same thing in framer so what i can do now is just get rid of this section i'm going to get rid of this section and i'm going to show you how to make it even better by adding some touches that will make this website website send out even more so it's going to be the best so yeah let's just remove this section 
And now what we can do is go to free pick to find a nice uh, video animation for our website, whether it's uh, some, uh, so just some free pick, not affiliate or anything. Uh, I click video here and I click find stock images, uh, stock videos, discover free videos. And here I'm just going to scroll and see if there is any kind of dark style videos that I like. So once I hover over them, I can see basically the result. And yeah, I'm just going to scroll through and see if and if there is any video that stands out to me that is very minimalistic because you don't want something that is too difficult or uh, grabs too much attention. So something like this could work. And now I'm going to download this video. Uh, once I downloaded it, I can go to a website which is cloud cloudinary.com or cloudinary.com and I'll just gonna upload this video here. And by the way, if you want to learn how to not just make beautiful websites, but how to make money making beautiful websites, how to launch your own apps, how to build stuff like that, you can sign up to my free course on uh, Lovable on how to build beautiful sites, how to make money making beautiful website, how to launch and how to grow. Uh, for now you can yeah you can sign up and you'll get notified first once it's out the link is in the description so once the core the video is loaded here i can now have accessed and i can now copy it in lovable there is simple prompt for this and this is just add the background video to this section to the let's say hero section background video layer um background video layer let's just get rid of this so here you would just paste the link to your video. So I'm going to go here. I'm going to click down and here I'm going to just click copy original. And once I did that, I can go to my website and just paste the link here. Position absolute instead zero. I don't have zero idea what that means. Auto play muted loop place line have zero idea what it means. Controls false. And I'm going to say also make the video have zero saturations because I don't really want it to have this bluish color. I want it to have grayish color and like that. So now I'm just going to send it. And just like that, here we have our beautiful side that took us literally a few minutes to make. It would took me about a few days to build something like this in Webflow or Framer. Even though I know those platforms, I would never go back to them. And it will and it look much better than what we got from the standard prompt. So yeah, this is what you get just by combining two prompts. And if you want to learn more, make sure to sign up to the waitlist for a course and make sure to check the templates, the good starting point on webflowing.com. Here you, by the way, can earn by submitting templates. If you do what I teach you in this video and if you can get consistent results like this and if you get consistent results like this or like this, you can... Um, apply your template here and if it gets accepted and if you see your template here it means you get a hundred dollars I will email you and I will wire you those money either crypto or uh, wire transfer and yeah but the results should be high quality something like you can see on this website which is pretty high quality if you can preview this website this is not just generic AI made website because uh, yeah it has to be high quality